I miss him now. Even though he was expecting it. It's been a tough week. Captain Tim Mackling still can't believe 33-year-old Wade Cannon is gone. No, I've cried a bunch this week, and, you know, it's... Today has just been tough. Mackling was Cannon's station chief at Flower Mound Fire Department. Cannon died on Saturday from stage 4 colon cancer, a disease he obtained while on the job, diagnosed in September of 2020. When he got diagnosed, it, it hit us like a ton of bricks. Occupational cancer is the leading cause of death for firefighters. That's according to the International Association of Firefighters. Dangerous carcinogens and toxic chemicals present at a lot of scenes like this. They often find their way onto bunker gear and can be absorbed through the skin. The CDC recommends getting screened for colon cancer at 45, but... Yeah, Cannon didn't make 45, right? A death like Cannon's at such a young age may underscore that firefighters should be screened sooner. There's an element to, uh, to other people getting checked out and knowing they're either okay or not okay um, that, that, that gives me a peace of mind that regardless of how this turns out, we won. This is Cannon. Before he died, he was urging firefighters to take occupational cancer seriously, to get screened sooner, and his push saved the lives of two in the department. I was not diagnosed as, as poorly as what uh, Wade's was. Like 46-year-old Justin Norris, who says here that his colon cancer caught early, more treatable after he was screened. I need people to go get checked. That was his motto, get checked. A life taken too soon, but a message that will live on. In Flower Mound, I'm Matt Howerton.